Today we're going to be showcasing what I think is probably one of the worst characters that you can pull out of the SR units. That is Gran Torino. He's a green int unit here. Let's have a look at him. We're going to showcase him only because I haven't showcased him on the JP side because they're obviously at the JP side. There was no reason why. But uh, to catch up on videos and stuff like that, you know, might as well throw it out there. So uh, this guy is trying to be like a Orcs kind of character where he's just like... The damage that he gets is based on his speed. Obviously, being SR, that is diminished. While speed is a good stat to upgrade sometimes, we're buffing it through memories and stuff like that. When your damage is fluctuating like that much, so easily, because you can't always buff the speed every single time, it can be really awkward for him. But I could be wrong. I could be wrong. Uh, he's plus soldier does 400% damage. All of his damaging skills are relative based on speed. 250% damage on his action skill 1, single target. It's a 3 turn cooldown. So a damaging move with a 3 turn cooldown is not bad. Action skill 2, increases crit rate, which is not bad. And if your HP is 80% or higher, increase the character speed by, 80, by 30%. While that is very good for an SR unit, it's so hard. Unless you have a taunting unit to be over 80% HP. If you're over 50% HP, he's auto skill 1 procs where he gets a 15% crit rate. So he's already getting 35% crit rate from getting like a pretty sick amount of health, which is cool. Is it worth it? Who knows? We'll see. And then auto skill 2 increases his speed by 30%. So at least he gets like speed and stuff like that, but you have to keep his HP at a maximum in order to get all these procs. So that's the one of the reasons why he's a little bit iffy. Like, there are obviously some auto skills from URs that have like a HP restriction kind of auto skill. But for example, Shigaraki, I think, has an auto skill where it procs when he's over 50% HP, and then an auto skill which procs when he's under 50% HP. So he's always getting a power buff regardless. But uh, when both auto skills can be destroyed if you drop underneath 50% HP, it can be very, very bad. For the ability board, he's on the fifth table. It's where he gets his three turn cooldown effect. Uh, he hasn't been any sort of useful character in any sort of content. Uh, VE Tower is not even a boosted character. So, yeah, we'll still bring him on VE Tower though. It's just that there's nothing, there's no real place to bring him on, honestly, unless you're a beginner and you need a green unit for USJ. But there's so many good green units and easy green units to reroll for that he's left in the dust. Versus Endeavor here. Uh, might as well go S difficulty. We have Nedry on the team, so... It'll be fine. L famous last words, because we're going to burn to death. Maybe it's not a good idea. You know what? That's the challenge. I think that's the challenge. Plus, if we have just, like... This kind of setup, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. So we need a memory that will boost up his speed. As a pro hero unit, I got nothing. <laughs> As a green pro hero unit, I actually have nothing unless... I got critical hit rate as well as skill impact. I have speed boost for other typings. I think we just have to go with the uh, critical boost. This gives us a plus ultra and power increase, which is boring. Let's do that then. Wait, no, that's a UA high teacher. Okay, well, scratch that. Um, we will do... Man, I don't have any good pro hero things. I guess we, we have to do this one then. As we can get this, and then Nedry can get this. Sure. All right, let's jump into it. I know the Shinto memory that I gave him does not work, but who cares? The point is we get to showcase our beautiful Gran Torino, the grandfather. All right, here we go. We gotta, we gotta proc the heal here. I'm not the seal. The, we gotta proc the seal here. Power down, which is good. No seal, which is bad. Alright, you target Izwa, which is good. 
So now we got the buffs going with the uh, Gran Torino. 50% power boost. He's got HP regen, critical rate up to 35% right there. Which is not bad. Speed up, which gives him more extra damage. So we will take that. We'll give him a power boost because why not? And we're going to see his amazing damage. 18,000 critical! And he's about to drop underneath his HP restriction. <laughs> oh my god. So now he's under 80% HP. Now, what does he have? I think he lost a little bit of power. He's still got the HP regen, which is good. And then the 35%. His power's up a little bit by um, Nedri. Nedry's key, man. Nedry's key if you want to keep him healthy. All right, let's see his plus ultra critical. No, 14,000. All right. But now he's getting healthy. He's full health, actually, shall I say. Can I get a seal? Maybe this time. Third time's the charm. Critical rate, speed up. There it is. No, not bad, boy. Uh-oh. <laughs> uh, definitely do this. I want to see if I can get a plus ultra. 9,000 damage. Not really worth it. Uh, is he gone? Is What's his speed up? 30%. Critical rate's 35. His power's diminished. But let's see what we can do here. I don't even think a Gran Torino UR would be good. 12,000. I mean, we just seal here. I mean, he's dead here. Regardless, in the next, like, upcoming turns. One, two. Uh, yeah, okay. I was like, maybe Gran Torino doesn't do enough damage, but he got a critical. Yeah, he's just he's just bad. <laughs> he's just bad. I can't make things up. He's just bad. Uh <laughs> Nedry makes him a little bit better because he can keep that consistent HP, but like, is it really what you can have any other green I can name like three other better green SR units. Maybe not now, but <laughs> There are definitely better green SR units to bring other than him. Like, maybe there's a situation where he's like a boosted VE tower unit, but other than that, like, nothing, nothing saving him right now. Anyway, that's going to wrap things up here. That's the showcase of Gran Torino. Let me know your thoughts about him in the comment section down below. Make sure you leave a like on today's video. That said, I'll see you guys in the next one. Until then, stay healthy, stay safe, stay fizzy. Peace out.